I'm Molly Cushing, Managing Editor at Ghost Volta. I fought the law, and the law won. And this is your TV Quickie for Friday, May 31st, 2013. Electronic Arts tea is what seems to be a mashup of Plants vs. Zombies and Mass Effect, something called Grass Effect, on its Facebook and Twitter pages today. They also tantalized something called Dead Face, which appears to bring Dead Space along for the ride as well. EA hinted that we'll see more of the mashup at E3 in June. Oh man, I'm totally going to be a renegade daisy in my first playthrough. In a Google Plus post today, Google stated that they will not add any facial recognition features to their products, specifically Google Glass, without having strong privacy protections in place first. This may not rule out these apps for the future, but Google certainly will need to have some insurance if they plan on allowing something so personal. Seriously. If you're gonna analyze my face, you're gonna at least have to buy me dinner first, Google. Naughty Dog plans to keep its current in-house engine, the one used to create the Uncharted series and upcoming title The Last of Us, for PlayStation 4 development. Rather than start from scratch with a new engine, as they did from PlayStation 2 to PlayStation 3, the company will instead modify and upgrade the current engine for the upcoming console transition. Game director Bruce Straley believes this will save them a lot of turmoil and headaches. And finally, Reddit user Blanchelle decided to combine her love of interior design with her love for testing and create the ultimate Portal 2 themed bedroom. Blanchelle carefully color coordinated her room and painted the walls herself by hand to capture the Portal 2 look she was going for. From Ratman scribbled messages on walls to glowing orange and blue portals, the bedroom has everything a loyal Aperture science tester could ever need. Now that's thinking with portals. That's it for today's quickie. Be sure to head over to GhostVolta.com for more content and, of course, more quickies. Have a great weekend, and we'll see you on Monday.